Welcome back everyone, this is Pine Leaf Plays the Rune Keeper. And we are heading now towards the Chamber of Mazerbul, where we will find out if anything is happening down there. Now this is not too far away, but just being things up a little bit. The 21st Hall North Arch. We hang a right here. Here's the chamber of Mazerbol, oh, which is in quite a wreck. Something collapsed the roof of this chamber. I know not what. There you are, Pinestone. I have some work for you. If you don't mind getting your hands dirty, I hope you don't want me to reconstruct this entire room. This place was called the Chamber of Mazerbol because it once stood important records of the day. Oh, it once stored important records of the day. At some point during the long years that Moria stood empty, the ceiling seems to have collapsed. As you can see, the whole room has been filled with rubble and debris. We're trying to search through the debris for anything of interest we can find. Help the dwarves with that task and bring me anything noteworthy. Alright, search some debris. Here's some, some debris. Oh, a book! Ooh. Is this book of any interest? Okay, well, let's bring it to Broger and find out. Alright. We will meet again at the Chamber of Leadership Command, or whatever they call it. Back in the Chamber of Leadership. And, Broker, here's a book. I cannot bear to read this book. Why, because it's so dirty? Broker takes the book from you and flips gingerly through some of the brittle pages. His breath catches as comprehension appears to dawn on him. This is the Book of Mazerbul, and it seems to contain a record of Balan's settlement. It is grim reading, Pinestone. If you would be so good as to bring it to my cousin Balsy, he will want to see it. He was always had more of a stomach than I for records such as this. I do not want to read this horrific end. It is enough for me to know that they are dead. Bossy is still at the Chamber of Crossroads in Durin's Way, north of the Great Delving. So, back to the Chamber of Crossroads. This way, that way, this way, that way. Well, I'll meet you back at the Chamber of Crossroads and see what happens. Here we are, back in the Chamber of Crossroads, and let's talk to Balsy. This looks to be grim reading. What but have you brought- I will do so from the beginning. What have you brought me, my friend? Balsy leaps through the book, and a look of deep sadness settles upon his features as he comes to understand what the brittle pages are saying. This is a record of Balan's expedition, and tells of their unhappy end. At least we now know what befell our kin in Moria. Black pit indeed. Or so it seems in my grief. I will read it from the beginning, but in the meantime I would have you help another matter that I may devote my attention to this. All right. The dwarves of my expedition are getting restless. One of my dwarves, a miner by the name of Suena, has taken it upon himself to attack the goblins of the Silvertine Lodes. He has the strength of limb to match his headstrong nature, but there are too many goblins in that place for even him to conquer alone. Oh wait, do not leave for Gamophilic just yet, for that is not where my dwarf has gone. Well, I, I didn't start leaving. 
Never mind. Uh, Swaina believes that the goblins have a home in the waterworks, and I heard him vow to follow the mining tracks that run through the Silvertine loads down to the flooded deeps themselves. Look for the southernmost track along your map. You will find Swaina searching there for goblins. I will continue to read from the book of Mazabul Pinestone, but you must journey to the southernmost reach of the Silver Teen Lodes to dissuade Suena from his foolhardy mission. I do not doubt that he will slay many goblins, but he will not know when to retreat. You must find him and rescue him from his own folly. All right, so we need to talk to Suena. That means getting back to the Silver Teen Loads. Yes, of course. So, I'll meet you back over there. Here we are back in the Silver Teen Loads, and let's head on down. But we're not going to head straight towards Suiana. In instead, we are going to head for... Thou far and take care of him at the next area. We'll do quite a bit of the silver team loads as we make our way towards Thalfar. And the camp we are looking for is right here. Now these must be pretty good mining tracks if ah. I know I know we'll find some that are broken and stuff like that, but let's face it. These mining tracks have been here for how long? Maybe a thousand years or such? Now, what really impresses me, alright, maybe the metal has survived, but the ties? <laughs> I mean, really? Well, it could be that they're repairing the ties. Maybe that's what's happened. That's a possibility, is that the dwarves have repaired... Them. Well, we'll see that there's some intact ties even later on down that aren't being held by the dwarves area. Alright, but in any case... Hello? If we are to find Mithra and Khazadum, we will first have to deal with the orcs. Ah, greetings to you, good elf. I am Goofy, at your service. Goofy? <laughs> It is a great day to be a dwarf, I tell you, and I am privileged to see the retaking of Casa Doom in person. As we arrived here, I noticed the railway directly to the west. I sense that there are untapped mining prospects there, for the loads of the Silver Teen are the richest in veins in all of Moria, and likely in all of Middle Earth. Would you be so good as to scout prospective paths in the tunnels and hang signs at the clear dead ends so that we know where to start our search? <laughs> All right. Bright prospects, dark rails. Hello, Valfar, I presume? What's so funny? It is said that Durin's bane dwells here, though we have not seen it. Well then... Let's hope we never do see it then. Hello, Traveler! Are you here to help us to get our feet wet? Good. Uh, we are always a uh, can use for another pair of hands. Even if they're attached to an elf? Alright, let's see. I doubt that Lord Balin still lives. Forgive me for placing yet another burden upon you. But the miners have complained that the platform of Menemberej is frequently overrun by goblins or other creatures, and they need to be patrolled more frequently to keep such threats at bay while they prospect for Mithril. I don't have my miners picked off by goblin filth. I need you to go patrol that platform and clear it of creatures to ensure the miner's safety. So we need to defeat creatures from Menem Berej. We can only hope that Durin's Bane sleeps deeply. 
Our best hope for finding Mithril in the Silver Team Lows is to reclaim and repair the platform of Menem Berege. If you ask me, if you would begin by restoring the wheels of the platform, we would be most... That would be most helpful. All right, so there we go. But first, let's go about and do this little scouting mission. And finding the various directions. All right. And now, I wonder how that happened. something fall down on top of the rail I guess because I just don't want to imagine the <laughs> what happened there but all right this doesn't look like a very good prospect here nope rails end in a dead end there that's rather obvious all right and Alright, and apparently these worms don't look very nice. Alright, anything here? Well, the, this passage is intact, but you see a sense of dread hanging around this particular tunnel. Whew! Uh, well, they'll have to do some repair work on the rails, though, if they are going to... get that working properly. Let's see what we have here. Uh, the rails stop at a dead end. Uh, oh, yeah, that's... Well... They could build a bridge, right? They're dwarves. They're good at building things. Surely they know how to build a bridge. Okay, maybe not the first place to go to, but in the long run, they could build a bridge there. And what else have we got here? And up this way, up here. This looks nice and okay, maybe not nice and intact. Oh, one of these crazy crawlers. We'll have to take care of them. Now, at least now I can understand what broke these rails. Well, hey, there's potential there, I say. I don't know. They could do a little repair work there. But disheartening, I guess. But I should, re but I think they could repair the rails, right? Well, I'll put a sign up there anyway. Sign. Rails need repairing. All right, that's an appropriate sign. Let's see. Where, where, ah, here, here we go. Put up a sign here. Need a bridge. And okay, a sign here saying completely blocked. Good. Those will be a nice set of signs for them. Okay, okay, okay. You're using a wheelbarrow. Oh. <sighs> Ever thought of taking advantage of the rails rather than trying to use a wheelbarrow on the tie? I'll oh, forget it. <laughs> All right, I posted the signs. The shadow of Mordor will not long fill the halls of Khazadum. What? And dread down the other one, you say? Bah! 
A dwarf does not fear a little dweariness in a mine shaft. According to you, that is the best and only road, and so that is where we will begin. I thank you for your report, Pinestone. However nonsensical its delivery. And thank you, a tad heap, too. Goofy is right. That is the right way to say his name. Goofy, Goofy, Goofy. <sighs> and next time we will go to Menem Berej to take care of the goblins that are on the platform. Then maybe we will handle this little task for Goofy. In the next episode of Finally Plays. The Roomkeeper.